Hey guys, it's Lexus. Welcome, welcome back to my channel. And today I'm going to be doing a what's in my pencil case video. And I love watching these kind of videos because I just think they're so fun and I love stationary items. So that's why I'm doing one. Also, real quick, I just want to say, um, I'm sorry I haven't been posting recently. Aww. I've just been kind of busy, but now I'm going to get back into posting normally. So let's get into it, guys. Okay, so first we're going to show you, well, I'm going to show you guys my pencil case. Here it is. It's from Vera Bradley. And um, as you can see, Vera Bradley on the little zipper tassel and it's um, this really pretty blue pattern here's the other side there's a few pin marks on it it's, it's, it's like there's one right here but you guys can probably see it on camera i don't think at least but it's really loud i'm sorry about that it's a pretty nice size bag for a pencil case it's actually not a pencil case it's a cosmetic bag bag but i'm using it as a pencil case because they didn't have the pencil case that I wanted in my like bat and the pattern that I wanted, so yeah. We're just gonna get into what's in here, so let's unzip it. All right, so the first thing that's in here is some extra markers. These have these two extra markers, they are pink and purple. I have a few more in my um. Oh, yeah, there. Yeah, I have a few more in my backpack, and these are from Target. I just love how they look, and they're really vibrant, so that's why I got the ones from Target, because they're vibrant. So those are the XO markers. Next, we have some sticky notes. Just have two packs of these little pink sticky notes. I use these a lot for student council, so that's great. And then we also have scissors, because um, you never know when you need scissors. They are like safety-ish scissors, I guess, and they're pink. And they're small and mini so they can just like fit right in here as you can see because if i had those like huge scissors they probably would not fit in here as well i have some whiteout it's this big whiteout correction tape it's like the one that you it's not like the obviously it's not the dipping one it's not the wet one you just like run it across so that's pretty handy i'm always using this especially in history when i take my notes so always need that all right and now we're gonna get into some of my pins in here first pack they are the sugar rush pins i have a huge pack of sugar rush pins that i got for christmas last year actually Ooh. i don't use these a whole whole lot it just depends on my day but they're just in here and they have like the smelling sugar rush huge pack of like 25 of these but they're just not all in here that i use those at home sometimes so these are just the sugar rush pins i have for school and then next, I have just um, two of these Papermate Flare pins. Mm, I have one blue one and one purple one. They work really good, but I just don't have that many of these. I don't know where I got these from, but I don't know. I have them. They're just in here. Just two Papermate Flares. So we just have plain black Sharpie, and it's the normal like tip one, I guess you could say. I don't really know what that would be called. Next, we have a yellow highlighter Sharpie. This is what I use sometimes when I'm highlighting stuff. And then I have this ultra fine point, and it's like the really fine marker sharpie. So you see sometimes when I'm writing my notes. And then lastly, I have this yellow Office Depot, Office Depot, Office Depot sharpie. And I thought, or highlighter. I just thought I would add this one, the sharpies. I didn't really know what category this would go in, but yeah, it's just a yellow, plain yellow from Office Depot. So I do have two yellow highlighters, and then I have two black sharpies one fine and one fine and then one normal all right fun fact about me i hate using pencils like i do not like pencils like pencils are like not i think my handwriting looks so bad with pencils i just don't like pencils but i have a few in here because i use these for math so they are all from bic all my pencils in here these are like the only pencils i use they're mechanical pencils it's like i have a hate for pencils but the only pencils i will use are use are mechanical pencils especially from Bic. I love Bic mechanical pencils. So I just have six little mechanical pencils that I bring to school because you never know when one will run a lead or whatever. These are mostly for math class and I use these sometimes in science, but that's about it. I don't really like to use pencils that much unless I'm in the mood for it. Next, I just have one Crayola marker because it's pink and I use it as a highlighter. Wow, I know, right? It just looks pretty, that's why. Next, um, I have two pens, and 
Fun fact about one of them, they're really nice pens. They're called R2 Blast, and they're really pretty. This is my favorite one because it's like a Tiffany green, purple, or purple, whoa, blue color, and it's really pretty, and I love it so much. But, um, no, I thought, like, the necklace chain was in the front. I'm like, oh. Um, the thing about the pink one is it, the bottom broke off because, um, one time I brought it out and I actually like flung it until it flung across the classroom and so the bottom part broke off so I still use it though because it's a pretty color and it's pink and I just write like this maybe I'll find them again one day I don't really know where they, they're from I got them for my birthday so who even knows where these are from so I don't know where they're from so that's that all right next I have just a pink little um eraser that I use it's also from Target as you can see it's a Target thing. Is, um, I love Target, and Target has good school supplies whenever it's school supplies time. All right, next we have my pencil sharpener. Also, oh, once again, wow, Target, what a surprise. Half of my pencil case is from Target. Actually, half of my backpack stuff is probably from Target as well. Anyway, next we have some more pens. Um, I do have two red pins. I don't use red pins that much, but these are for grading, especially, oops, for whenever we're in Spanish or English, we have to grade with red pen. So these are for Spanish and English. And I'm trying to speed this up kind of, because I feel like it's gonna take forever. But for guys, so as I say, I'm gonna run out, I'm, I'm running out of time. I don't wanna make this video too long. I run out of storage, yay. Anyway, let's just keep going. Like I was talking about, red pens for Spanish and English, and they are from Paper Mate, if you were wondering. They're both from Paper Mate. Dry erase marker from H-E-B, apparently. I didn't know it was in here, but cool. Dry erase marker. It's actually a really fine tip, like, y'all. Look how fine that is. I love that. Okay. Anyway, next thing we have in here. Um, all right, we have more pens. All right, I'll just threw away a piece of paper that was trash. Anyway, we have these blue and green pens. One's with, like, this blue color. Oh my goodness. Did y'all see that? The I opened the pen and it flung out of my hand. Okay, anyway, both of them. It was this blue color. Kind of matches my shirt, not gonna lie. Or maybe not really. I thought it did. Whatever. And then we have this green one. And I don't know where they're from because I literally rubbed the name off of them, as you guys can tell. You can just tell how much I used, I used these pens because I rubbed the names off, but... If you want to find these pens, then just look for a bottle that looks like this, I guess. I don't really know. Um, anyway. Next, um, we have some more pens. I know, right? Wow, you have more pens? Yes. I have this pink clicky pen from Papermate. It's an Ink Joy. Love these pens so much, and it's pink. And I want to get more of these pink Papermate um, Ink Joy click pens because they're so good. Next we have, um, let's see, we have this Pilot Pen. Also, I love Pilot Pens. This one's in black. This is like my favorite, favorite, favorite pen. It's my history pen most of the time, and I have to use this all the time in history. Next we have a highlighter that is pink from Bic. It's the bright liner ones, and has the grippy things, which I love that. And I have more of these in my backpack, but I really just, I had a history the other day, and I just threw them all in my backpack, the ones I was using, so, mm, yeah. All right, next we have these paper mate pens and they are just black. I have two of them and they're ink joys, which I love that. And they're just both black. And um, yeah, that's cool. They're just both black ink joys. And actually I just bought them the other day. So here's the box. They're just some ballpoint ink joy pens. Yeah, this is just the box that they came in. I just bought these literally the other day. So I thought I'd show you guys the box. But yeah. My favorite pens ever, Paper Mate. Go buy Paper Mate if you don't have any. They're literally the best pens ever. But yeah, two black Paper Mate um, clicky pens. And I love clicky pens too because they're so fun to click. All right, the next thing that we have are some colorful pens. Once again, um, what is, we have some colorful pens from Paper Mate. What a surprise at this point now. We have two blue pens, um, the darker blue ones from Paper Mate. And then we have one lighter blue paper mate pen, one orange paper mate pen, purple paper mate pen, and lastly, a pink paper mate pen. And I have um, a huge pack of these, like I have, so it came with a pack of two of each color, so we have 
two more of each of these colors. So yeah. Alrighty, and that's it. The pencil case is empty. Wow. By the way, I'll just show you guys the inside of it real quick. Just gonna reverse the look at inside out real quick. Oh my well here is the inside if you guys are wondering what it looks like. It's clear and it has a liner, which I love that. So then um my pins and stuff don't like bleed all over the inside and so then like my bag when it that's what happened to me last year i bled like pin exploded and it's all my old backpack and on it's on the bottom of my old backpack it exploded through my pencil case and i'm so mad so sorry this is really loud but the liner is extremely loud so i'm really mad and um yeah i was i got really upset and it looks way bigger without stuff in it too I have so much stuff it literally fills the room but that's what it looks like and it's clear and this is the inside of my pencil case if you guys want hopefully it doesn't spill out yep it's pretty filled to the room as you guys can see oh oh and they spilled okay guys i hope you enjoyed seeing what's in my pencil case please like and subscribe and comment down below any other video ideas and also comment down below if you are more of a pen person or a pencil person personally i'm a pen person but i want to see what you guys think all right, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.